Item number SCP-6071, Object Class Euclid, Special Containment Procedures. SCP-6071's entrance perimeter is to be constantly watched by two security personnel members. Additionally, they must enter SCP-6071 every three days to check SCP-6071-A status. Description SCP-6071 refers to a structural assembly located in the underground vicinity of Site 4. The date of its building is currently unknown, as well as its constructor. However, due to its various mechanisms found inside, it is believed that it was created between 1968 to 1970. The construction itself does not have the capacity of an adequate structure to be underground, and due to this, it is extremely deteriorated. Internal changes had to be applied to it to avoid possible collapses. Foundation's local stampings can be found at some points in the complex. Additionally, SCP-6071 has multiple rooms, some destroyed due to the previously mentioned details. Excavations are currently being carried out in search of possible information added to the nature of the construction. December 7th, 2021. Corrupted files similar to instructions have been found. Addition of pending addenda for December 9th of this year. It has been found SCP-1671 structure is found around a central cell to which SCP-1671-A is contained. For more information, see Addendum 6071-1. Addendum 6071-1 Recovered Documentation After an initial reconnaissance in the reception area, multiple documents were found in a nearby office belonging to Eliza Anderson. Subsequent searches of the current whereabouts were inconclusive. Iteration 1 Items Designation Number 4099N4TG00D768 Notice, the item has properties that allow it to breach containment at any time. Items Description Five keys octahedron composed of Sly 37. Note, a metal created by alloying 70.7% of U92 and 20. 1% of PU94 and 10.2% of ASL56. Resistant to all known stresses. Resistant superior to any anomalous and non-anomalous minimal discovered at the time this document was found. Contentainment details. All personnel members whose function is to check the status of the abnormality must have memetic inoculation. Report. Unreadable. The object seems to have cognitohazardous properties that cause closeness to it. Any individual who comes into direct eye contact for a continuous period of four minutes will be affected and will try to establish a friendly relationship with it, sharing interests and information. It has been observed that the subjects affected by the abnormality tend to convince unaffected individuals to transfer or release the object. The item has been found to be attracted to a specific location which is close to the current unreadable. Note, the object does not follow any communication system that can be detected with anti-cognito hazardous filters or the like. However, knowing the type of properties it has, it is possible that a subsequent application of amnestic treatment to an affected subject may be more than enough to eliminate any trace of them. Tests are in progress. Researcher Eliza Anderson, Department of Abnormalities. Iteration 2. Interviewed, EP6436, Sebastian Imanes. Interviewer, Researcher Eliza Anderson. Begin log. It wants to see the world, you know. Why? Well, was made to admire that, or so it says. Creation, at the end of the day, became so beautiful to be beheld. I understand. However, 
Prior testing has proven it does want to go to Site B. Is there any particular reason for that? Ed wants to meet with him. Them? It's hard to explain. It feels curious about expunged cognito hazard. Thank God I've got to fill this on. I truly doubt that's something I can comprehend too directly. Explain it in other words. A different thing, a more advanced thing to say something. This doesn't clear any doubt either. Anything else? It wants to see you. Me? For what? It thinks you, and only you, can do something to turn the tables, make everything better, more favorable. It thinks you, and only you, can do something to turn the tables, make everything better, more favorable. I see. We're done for today. And Nog. Iteration 3. Months have passed since the object was contained. I can't really suffer from several dreams about it, although I only remember fragments of them. I cannot say that it is anything that addresses any real conclusion. Only cold and sterile facilities, with things I cannot remember, and I think that, even if I could, I wouldn't fully understand. Results are expected with everything I am doing. But I really don't know what to do. I think it's time to try something different. Researcher Eliza Anderson Iteration 4 Interviewed 4099N4TG00D768 Interviewer Researcher Eliza Anderson Begin Law Its happening is inevitable. Soon or later, the Catechism will be unleashed. And for that moment, what will happen? They'll all be free once again, through the world, the galaxy, the universe. There's no specific answer for that. There are so many variables, and all of them are so different, they can't be predicted. So whatever we're doing now is completely futile. Partially. What do you mean? As I've said, whatever has to happen will happen. However, there is a way to repair the situation so this will not occur again. It's inevitable, yes, but it doesn't mean it's irremitable. I still don't understand. You can probably prepare everything in such a way here is a record that, first of all, we were here, and second, everything can be diverted. But how? There are many ways, and it's preferable to do all of them as soon as possible. Secure the main headquarters, which is the reason it attracts me so much. And with that, we can leave useful information in other places till I do ex machina for the next ones. And then, and then what? We'll wait. For what? For them to contain. And log.